Shiba Inu is definitely holding up and holding strong. I'm going to get into this, show you a few key things, give you a state of the union of kind of all of crypto, as well as the new inflation numbers that came out today, kind of how that's impacting uh, crypto on the broader level, and then ultimately distill it down and how it's impacting SHIB as well. So as I said, kind of with the headline here, uh, Shiba Inu holding strong, it's really doing actually well. It's up 4.5%. At four, you know, five zero nine nine, about to retake that zero again. On the one day, it's up four point five. On the seven day, we're up nineteen plus percent, and on the one month, we're up twenty nine percent, thirty two percent. As we as we look here, so let's uh, real quickly take a look at what's going on with Leash. So Leash is up three percent on the one day, ten on the seven day, twenty percent on the month, and Bone kind of similarly. Let's see how we're doing there. Bone's flat. Bone's been just a little bit flat. I think it's waiting to really take off. We know that Shibarium is going to be launched this uh, in the you know on the fifteenth, sixteenth, basically next week. We know that's going to happen. Lots of big stuff there. On the one day, we're up one percent. On the seven day, I think we unless this resets, yeah, we're actually down 0.73 on the seven day, and then up twenty six percent on the one month. I think that Bone's going to really run over two plus dollars as we get a little bit closer to the launch here of. Shibarium. And there you go. There we just moved up 26%. Let me look at seven day. That just doesn't seem right to me. But we have had some down days kind of in the middle. Uh yeah, like right there where we were down a little bit. So that's that so that coin market has been weird about re uh recaching this website, if you will, or the, this page. Okay. So here's what here's the other thing I wanted to show you about. So basically July inflation data may take the heat off the Fed. So kind of the rumblings and what's going on on the stock side of the street is that. Today's inflation data, the CPI report, uh, came in basically in line with expectations. It does show inflation cooling a little bit, meaning it's more flat line than going down. That's OK. But uh, stocks are overall reacting fairly positively to this. And you can see that crypto in general is still in the negative. Now, earlier today, it was down about one. This number right here was down about one point. 2%. So we've erased all of that loss and basically come back to being flat. Okay. And right now, SHIB is really one of the, highla the, the highlights of what's going on. And you can see XTC, Rocket, Thor, SHIB are, are really the only ones that are really up um, in that regard. Sorry for the noise. Got some construction workers here working on the house. But, you know, this is where we're at. And so let's take a look real quickly at, you know, what's going on with SHIB as it relates to uh, trading view. This is the chart here, obviously. What you're also seeing is this is my software, X1 Algo, showing you momentum up, momentum down. Basically, these are buy and sell alerts, if you will, and showing kind of on these momentum up uh, scenarios like this one right here. Obviously, that was a really nice move up, 17%. This one right here, this one, another 8 plus percent. Uh, this one here, kind of where it fired really here, uh, we're up about 4%. Uh, and, and the other thing I would show and point out here is the minimization of risk. And so kind of like right here, this shows that if you would have had X1 algo, momentum down, alert, fires. By the way, you can get alerts on your cell phone and on your desktop on, through the TradingView app. Um, hey, there's a momentum down signal per X1 algo software, uh, you may want to think about selling to lock in profits because we remember we had a 21% move up here. So you could have sold on the high. And then after this momentum down alert shows it and all that, it's kind of cool, right? So it's ultimately it helps you give you insight into better trading and all that kind of stuff. Now the software works perfectly. Uh, I've had it built. It's been, I've been testing it for two months and uh, it's running. You can see it's real time data. By the way, it works on crypto. It works on stocks, works on everything. You can see like right here, it's on Apple stock. Look at this, like momentum down here. So it, it gave you a momentum down candle and right there all the way down. That's about a 7% move. So you could have sold Apple if you happen to own it and basically kept almost 8% profit by selling it because of that momentum down alert that's that's showing and then also you can see right here uh it's already showing a momentum up right there as well anyway point here it is i'm making is that it works on crypto works on stocks forex etc you can use it anywhere in the world doesn't matter where you're at in the world um you can use it 
anywhere globally uh, on your cell phone, on this device, uh, you know, mobile device, everything. Very, very quickly going to be launching here pretty soon, working out a few final details of the website, but it's on its way. So that's all I got. I'm looking forward to uh, helping you guys out as much as I can with this indicator X1 algo and, and uh, with all that. So right now that's where we're at with SHIB holding strong. Rest of the market's kind of flat. I'll see you.